In this video, I'm going to show you how I make dark synth beats for future. And his darker style beats don't really have too many melodic elements. So it's really more about layering sounds. So yeah, let's get right into it. Hey Cash, let's go crazy. Alright, so I got Keyscape loaded up and I have one of the LA custom presets. And I'm going to change the tempo to... We'll drop it down to like 133. And let's just build something out. Alright, so for this one, I think I'm going to start off with just some simple chords so I'll start off with F sharp major or minor chord So there's a lot of tension in that chord, but I kind of want to leave it like that. And I'm going to switch it out to, I'm going to change it from a piano sound. So we'll leave it like this. And we'll kind of build. Um, matter of fact, I'm going to kind of switch up these chords and just make it more melodic. Alright, so right now I'm really just kind of messing around with the notes, still staying within that chord and um, just making it sound a little more melodic, adding a couple um, notes in between. Alright, so that's pretty solid and then we're going to add a bass line. I'm gonna grab these notes right here and bring them, bring them up an octave. We'll do the same one to be this one right here. Just adding a bit more, and then we're gonna switch this sound up. Go back to Omnisphere, and then we'll go to. We'll try the. All right, so we're gonna go to synth. Uh, we'll do the long section, and then just randomize to see what we can find in here. I like this right here. So I just soloed this section out. I didn't really like that harsh synth. And we'll leave this. I think I'm gonna add halftime to this.
give it all that low wind. And it already kind of has a bit of reverb to it, so I really don't got to add too much. Maybe just a chorus or something, but we'll leave it real simple for right now. But right now we'll just adjust the level. Kind of bring it down a bit. Alright, so we'll add a counter now. Alright, so now I want something that will kind of fill in the rest of the EQ range. Kind of something in the background. So I'm thinking about adding a pad. Something that's just a little more subtle. So we're actually going to take this same pattern, copy it over, and then see if we can find a good pad. I like this, maybe with half time it will bring it down, kind of slow everything down to the right amount. Yeah, that sounds pretty dope. Uh, we'll cut out the low end, cut out some of those highs, and then just kind of have this sit in the background. I think like that. Alright, so that's pretty solid. So now I'm actually trying to find a good counter to bring into just like the intro. Alright, so we're going to open up the synth lead section and just try to build some out. Alright, so I'm going to add a string to this, but it's um, it's a very airy type of string. Uh, it just adds a lot of eeriness to it. So it'll just be like a real simple pattern. Yeah, some real simple like that. Just kind of add a bit more eeriness to it. And then I'm going to go into the EQ right here. Kind of control some of these frequencies. Alright, so one last thing I'm going to add before I do the drums is a sub bass. And I have this um, stringless, stringless bass preset from Omnisphere. And I already kind of been messing around on the keys. So I got, I'm going to play some out real quick. Yeah, real, real simple. We'll just quantize this. Alright, so I'm going to go to the EQ right here. And kind of bring up some of these lower mid frequencies right here. Alright, let's go ahead and start adding some drums now. So I'm going to start off with the, the hi-hat.
sometimes I'll solo out everything, even the clap and the hi hat, just kind of really focusing on the bounce of the 808. Alright, we're gonna add some percussion to kind of add some more bounce to it. some snares too. Alright, I'm gonna finish it off with the hi-hat now. Just add some rolls to it. Alright, so that's how I make dark synth beats. It's really not too hard. It's more about uh, just layering sounds. Um, it's not really too many melodic elements that it has in it. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video and you guys want to see another one like it, make sure you watch the next video that pops up in the end screen. And I'll catch you there. Peace.